this six billion euros is, is very small, I think. And in Albania, it's not going to change uh, very much. It would be a different uh, discussion if it were like 60 billion or I know much more than uh, much more than that. Uh, Albania has big needs, uh, especially in infrastructure. I think, uh, for example, the rail infrastructure is almost non-existent. Uh, it doesn't have any connection with the other countries in in uh, in the region. And uh, one of the best ways to transport uh, uh, goods and equipment uh, all over Europe is, is especially uh, rail transport, which uh, the region lacks. And it has been always mentioned as one of the main key problems in the economic development of, of the region. The countries of the former Yugoslavia, because they were one state, once they have, let's say, a better connection, transport connection with each other, but Albania is a little isolated from uh, from the region. I think they are too ambitious. Even in the beginning, when I saw the plan and the sum, which was 6 billion for the whole region, I think this was way too ambitious because the region has a lot of right. problems, economic, uh, social living, uh, uh, salaries, etc. So you cannot bridge the gap uh, so fast in six years. It would be, I think, a European record if they do it, which if right. they haven't done it in the last 30 years, uh, I don't think they are going to do it in six uh, in the next six years. So if they can, after six years, it could go to 50%, for example, of the European Union, it would be a success. But I doubt it that right. you can go in six years from 32% to 50% of the average GDP yes. per capita of the, of the European Union. It's, it's way too much. If the sum would be like 60 billion, let's say 10 times uh, bigger than this, I would start to believe, yes, it, it's very serious and very ambitious. But the sum at the moment, it's, it's very small to make, uh, to make this kind of uh, development in just six years.